People ask me numerous times, Idris, would you fight Mike Perry in bare knuckle? Why not? I'll fight him in bare knuckle, then I'll fight him in boxing, and I'll beat him twice. What's going on, guys? Woo-wee! This video is very interesting. Mike Perry fought Diego Alvarez in bare knuckle BFC. Would you say he's a bit staged? Would you say he slipped? Mm. Let's just react and let's dig into this video. And I give my two cents, my fair cents, my ten cents in, my reaction cents in. The guy looks a bit active. Looks really active. Looks mean. Looks ready. He looks like he's on it to beat Mike Perry. Pink and blue. One hundred eighty-four pounds even. So he wanted to fight me at one seventy-five pounds, and he's fighting his fight at one eighty-four pounds even. Hmm. Can Mike Perry get down to the weight to fight me? Hmm. Fair play. Why does he try to look mean? Why does he try to look mean? King of violence and it was in my face twice and he didn't do nothing to me when we squared off. It's intense people. Raw realize with the bare knuckle fighting people, the ring's different, man. It's like a big circle. The boxing's at squared. But then, then again, for MMA circle as well. He looks stiff, man. Ooh, nice body shot. Jab to the body, nice one. Okay. He can't box. Mike Perry can't box. Mike Perry can't box. Mike Perry can't box. He cannot box. He can't box. Nah. 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 I'm not having it. I'm not having it. How's he hurt? How does that make any sense? Nah, man. Nah, but you guys are kidding me. Alvarez was in there for a payday. Look at the replay. That was in the left hook. That was in the left hook. Guys, start what you are doing right there. Have you subscribed to my channel? Please subscribe to my channel so we can carry on building and I can carry on bringing you guys some fantastic content. Stop. Subscribe. That left hook, people. In that instant replay, that left hook. There's no power. No power at all. No power at all. What the? Fargo Alves, who's this geezer, man? This is, this is bollocks. Send me this guy to Unmitsfits. Let me fight this Fargo Alves. 
This is shocking. Look at look at him, look at him, look at him, look at him, look at look at everyone look at Mike Perry, look at him. Everyone look at <laughs> look at him, look at him so gas. Fair play to him, got a knockout, fair play to him, but come on man. Really? Really? He's no king of violence. No king of violence. No king of violence. I want to see what he says next. What was he saying on his mic? Let's see what he says. You got that done very, very quickly, proving why you are the king of violence. There's a lot of folks out here tonight watching you. What do you have to say to him? My easiest fight yet, just like I said it would be. I'm the undisputed king of bare knuckle. I'm number one pound for pound. Fuck anybody who thinks differently. I'm the king of this bitch. Come and see me, bro. If you want the smoke, if you want the money, I want all the smoke and all the money. I'll come and see you. 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 Show me the money. I don't know who he was on about, bro. Mike, what more can you do, my friends? What more can you do? Who is on your hit list now? Darren Till, you fat fucking bitch. Get your ass over here or I'm coming to UK. Yo, Nate Diaz got a fight with Jorge Masvidal. Some East Coast versus West Coast shit. Just throw the hands. I would have asked for a face off, but he would have told me to square off with myself, motherfucker. So, so shout out to him, man. I look, I ain't a hater, bro. We all out here trying to make it, and I'm fucking fighting for every step I take. Passionate, he's passionate. It's funny how he's left me out. Passionate, passionate. Crazy, crazy post interview by Mike Perry. He called out Darren Till. He knows Darren Till ain't gonna step in the ring to fight him. He knows one person he should have called out. He should have called out myself, the bodybreaker, but he didn't. He's picked Darren Till because he knows Darren Till is an easier fight. He knew if he called me out on Ben Hooker FC right there live and everyone's watching, then he knows he have to come and see me because he's called my name out on that platform. He played a smart move. Right about now, with me and Mike Perry, I think we're playing chess. I think we're playing checkers. I think we're playing Scrabble. If that makes any sense. <laughs> but Mike Perry needs to come see me. He says he wants to. He wants to say he wants to make legacy. He's passionate of where he wants to go. So I'm sending another message to you, Mike Perry. Let's get it on. You mentioned about Nate Diaz's fight in June the first. You look like you didn't really have a scratch on you. Let's fight on June the first if you're if you're willing to fight. As you said, it's West Coast v West Coast, but this won't be West Coast v West Coast. This will be West Coast v the UK coast. Let's get it on, Matt Perry. Stop running. Got a good performance against um, Phil Alvarez. I, I don't know if he slipped. I don't know if he took a dive. It didn't make no sense there from that little left hook. I don't think you've got any power. I don't think that was a power shot. It was a bit crazy how he went down. I think he was already scared. I think he lost the battle before he entered the ring. But Mike Perry, look into my eyes. Let's get on your next fight, Mike Perry. Let's let let it be me v you. Show me the money. You've already said we're all out here to make it. I'm out here to make it, make a name for myself. People ask me numerous times, Idris, would you go in the bare knuckle um, cage? Would you fight Mike Perry in bare knuckle? Yes, I will fight Mike Perry in bare, bare knuckle. Why not? I'll fight him in bare knuckle, then I'll fight him in boxing, and I'll beat him twice. So you guys let me know. Do you think it's a good option for me to fight him in bare knuckle, or do you think it's a better option for me to fight him in boxing? Let me know in the comments below. Also, people, I want to say a big shout out to everyone who's been subscribing to my channel, watching my videos, and also liking the videos. Big love to you guys, and thank you for the support. But you already know how we end our videos. Free.
two, one. Woo!